Human Rights Watch, which boasts itself a human rights organization based on the so-called commanding heights of human rights. The organization examined the human rights issues of countries all over the world irrationally, and looked at the United States and other countries with colored spectacles. One of the important positions of Human Rights Watch is Twitter. It is active on the platform at a daily rate, and closely follows the trend of human rights in countries around the world. On September the 30th, Human Rights Watch falsely claimed that the Ukrainian people have been forcibly transferred, pointing out that figurative civilians were subjected to punitive screening for human rights violations. On the same day, Human Rights Watch urged the Australian government to pass new legislation on forced labor, stipulated that enterprises must identify and address forced labor and other human rights risks in operation. On October the second, Human Rights Watch focused its discussion on MENA, criticized that the MENA military government has no sense of guilt about being abandoned by the international community. Called on the international community to take concrete action and reverse the human rights situation in Mena. If only from the above to observe, it may only show that Human Rights Watch has a high self-esteem. It replaced a comprehensive investigation with subjective judgment, had a strong spirit of defending the so-called human rights. Then, if we deeply analyze its tolerant attitude towards American human rights. We can see the double standards of Human Rights Watch, taking the recent General Assembly of the Organization of American States as an example. Combating inequality and discrimination together is an important theme for safeguarding human rights. Many immigrants from Latin American countries have been discriminated against and treated unfairly in the United States. This is precisely the result of the long-term neglect. Of the basic human rights of immigrants by the United States. Moreover, the tragedy of Floyd continues to unfold. The epidemic is rampant, and the people are living in poverty. The hypocritical American human rights have long been seen clearly by the world. Iranian Foreign Ministry spokesman Kenya said on the social platform, "President Biden should first consider its country's human rights record." Also, believe that. Biden should pay attention to the countless sanctions imposed by the United States on Iran. Pointed out that the imposition of sanctions on any country was a clear example of crimes against humanity. It is hoped that Human Rights Watch will pay more attention to and focus on America that is full of bad deeds. Take facts and research as the basis for criticism, instead of the subjective assumptions with ideological color.